Hey guys, Emily from Create 86 here, and today I'm bringing you the last installment of One Book July 2017, straight from my pool. Oh, and there's Ben Ben. Straight from the pool. There's our palm tree. Not real. So, I am still in my Recollections Traveler's Notebook, and I'm still working on my Seven Habits of Highly Effective People um, read through. So, put that aside. Let's do a quick flip through. I'm still in the same little notebooks that I have. And let's start from the beginning. This is, since this is the last week, I'll show you exactly how far I've gotten. This was habit one. Start of habit two. Habit three. Habit four, and that's what I've gotten up to so far. Um, so it's taking me about a week a habit, which is fine with me. Um, some nights I'm just more tired than others, and I don't have the energy to do it when I get home. Um, then I've also started other projects as well. So that's that. But I, I'm getting a lot of great information. I'm learning things I didn't know before. Um, and that's that. So I'll just keep working like each, I think there's a page and a half for each one. Yeah. So there's habit six, there's habit seven. And it's nice that it's self paced so I can go as fast or slow as I want. Here's my one book July 2017 um, like notes notebook. So let me take that off. This was like what my goals were for the month. Here's my first page of notes and my second page of notes. So I've only really added this little note right here, which is fine. Um, obviously I'll keep adding to it. I may not fill up the whole book in one go. I may use it for multiple books and just keep this as my, um, you know, planner for the next book that I wanted to read. Um, 52 Ways to Live a Kick-Ass Life will be my next book. And then I still have my craft folder right here. These are just, I don't even know why I have these in here. They're just Bilofax extra pages. I guess I didn't have room for them. Um, I still have my notes section. I use some washi. Oh, look at that hair on there. Um, I have some washi in there, which I will use. And I have this book, which I've literally done nothing in. I haven't used it yet. I'm sure I'll get to it. Um, it is definitely a priority, but I just haven't gotten there yet. So, this is my final One Book July 2017 video, and I have to say, I've really enjoyed it. I like working I've, I like working at my own pace, and I'm glad that I stayed in the same notebook. Um, and I've just really enjoyed it. It's, uh, I always love One Book July. I've, it's something to look forward to every, every July, and I hope Robini keeps going with it and bringing new challenges every year. Um... And so I guess I did the first one, which was stay in your one notebook, and I used this pen the whole time. It's a Recollections, like, pen gem type pen, and it writes beautifully. It's heavy metal, so that's nice. So it's weighted in your hand, um, and I've used that the whole time. And I think I just like taking notes. Like, I think I'm pretty decent at taking notes when I'm reading. I read pretty fast, but I like to take my time. Um... And actually, like sometimes I'll repeat the video or parts of the videos. Um, so I did identify my roles and my goals. Um, well, roles really, not goals yet. Um, and I picked up a lot of great quotes. That's pretty much what what I'm doing is writing down quotes and some of the main points. Um, I like to do the application questions on 188. Um, so yeah, there's that. And I will just keep going with it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed One Book July. And that you're doing great with your challenge. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.